Hello YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to calculate ages in Excel. Um, so I've got uh, an, a birthday column here, I want to calculate the age. So I'm going to do equals date diff, that's the function I want to use. Uh, it doesn't show up in the Excel documentation and it doesn't have the little uh, helper window here. So uh, I'm on my own to remember this formula, but it's an easy one. It's going to be the start date which is the date, uh, which is the birth date. So I'm gonna start on the birth date, so B2. And for age, we wanna figure out the difference between today and the birthday, right? So I'm just gonna do the, the today function, today, and then open parentheses, close parentheses, and then a comma. And then the final argument of this formula is the interval, which I want a year. So I'm just gonna put year uh, in quotation marks enter there we go um that is both probably the easiest and uh, most accurate way to do it because it accounts for leap years so what excel would rather have me do is subtract these two dates so i could do today minus the birthday which is b2 and hit enter and that's going to give me this is the number of days between those two dates so then to get the number of years, Excel then says, just to divide between 365. In almost all cases, that's going to be accurate and good enough for you. <laughs> um, but if you want to be really precise, uh, you do need to use that diff function so it accounts for leap years. Uh, hopefully that was helpful.